Boots is session number two. Boost Mobile highlights and NTI Townsville 500 this weekend at Reed Park. Beautiful conditions. It was up one degree for air temperature compared to the first session. 22 degrees out there and the first opportunity for teams to rehearse for what will be a fuel and tyre pit stop race this weekend. And Bryce Fullwood overstepping the mark dramatically in the middies entry, arriving on the concrete and getting extremely sideways. Did get away with it. A few people brushed the wall. That was James Courtney just rubbing up against the tyres there. Put some gravel rash on the side of that car. Brock Feeney, one of two rookies in the field this weekend. Clean, bold, Mark Dutton, the car controller. No injuries, thankfully. Cam Waters has been strong this weekend, remembering that he was also very quick here in 2021 and off the back of a victory in Darwin as well. But fine form being shown by Andre Heimgartner. A podium for him in Western Australia, a podium at Winton. Strong performances in Darwin, good practice form earlier in the day and finishes this session together with his engineer, Tony Woodward, celebrating the notion of having achieved a 1 minute 13.4 to be the fastest above Cam Waters by 0.09 of a second. Practice starts at the end of this one as well. That's David Reynolds. And he won't be happy with that. And, and that start had pretty bad wheel spin. Andrew Edwards was actually his starter and actually waving him on the side of the fence there. In fact, through the right-hand side of the fence that we're looking at there at the moment. So some of the drivers either doing it and taking their own cue and others just being given the nod from someone in the crew. Sat down a lot in the rear, didn't it? Will Davison being the king of armour all pole positions in 2022. <laughs> he turned it so hard to get onto those two black stripes. So you can see it's sitting there in neutral. He's got his finger on the line locker, so that's effectively like a handbrake. He's finding the bite point in the clutch. He's setting the throttle percentage. Slowly bleeds it off the line. That was a nice start. Didn't look like it had too much wheel spin. Didn't bog down. Well, that's what he needs to be able to do tomorrow. Brock Feeney does the same. Scott Pye, who's been quick so far this weekend. He's just finished up 10th in that session. He was strong in practice one as well in the new line entry. Cool drive entry in the background there. Tim Slade gets away pretty cleanly as well. It looked like Todd Hazelwood getting away. And an important practice start there for James Golding as well. Chaz Mostert now on screen. A lot of energy conversion there. Some wheel spin in the latter part of that. And the teams will look at this data after this session to measure the 0 to 100 kilometre an hour time interval to see whether or not the job was done well or not. Heimgartner, great time. 13-4, home by 9 one hundredths of a second over Cam Waters. Shane Van Gisbergen, who was the quickest in the first session, then Mostert, Jones, Davison, Forward, Perk, I beg your pardon, Hazelwood, then Perkat and Pye.